I'm here with Spencer on the countdown to the trip to Gothenburg. Uh, Spencer, your life has changed a lot in the last 12 months from Rio. What could you say is, is different? Uh, oh my goodness, there's so many things that have changed on so many levels. Uh, number one, I think uh, the horse has changed significantly since then, feels much bigger and stronger and, and more able to cope with everything that he's asked of. Um, and I think from my point of view, there's been some little doors that have opened and uh, it's all been a very, very positive experience. Do you ever hear, tire of hearing Spencer Wilton, Olympian? <laughs> no, never. <laughs> no, I mean, it's really, it, it's such an amazing feeling to have been part of it. Uh, and, and, and it's something that, I don't know, maybe with other championships it's slightly different, but with this certainly, no, no one seems to forget about it, so that's the best thing. And we've seen Neville sort of go from strength to strength since Rio, personal best after personal best. So what are your thoughts on Gothenburg for the pair of you? Um, I, I mean, he's, he has been brilliant this year. And, and like I said, he's feeling a lot stronger and more able to cope with everything. Uh, I think that in a championship environment, um, to, to try and do another personal best or, or, or match my personal best from this year would be a bit of a tall order. But... Uh, uh, that's my aim, but uh, we'll see. It might, it might be, uh, might be next year, next year's championships that we uh, really sock it to them. And the team's going to have a very different feel this year without Charlotte and Vallegro. Um, but I think it's nice for the four boys to be together. What do you think the time di team dynamic will be like? Um, obviously, it's going to be quite different. But I mean, we all we've known each other for a long time, and, and we all get on. So uh, I think that it'll be hopefully we'll have a lot of fun. Probably not as much fun as we had in Rio with Charlotte and Fiona, maybe. But uh, uh, I'm sure we'll have a lot of fun. And it's a good team. It's a strong team. And obviously, with the other guys, they've had a lot of experience at championship level. So. Um, I think it'll be good. And come a few weeks' time, what do you think that team podium would be like? Who's going to be your gold, silver and bronze choice? Um, uh, oh, controversial. I think we'll have to give the gold to Germany, definitely. Uh, I think that people are going to call me negative, but I think maybe we could get the bronze if everybody goes really well. And then I think possibly Holland or maybe Denmark for the silver. Not sure. We'll see. You, I'm sure you'll all do your best to get that silver or bronze or even gold. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thanks, Spencer.